Chapter 474 Therefore, Yin was pinning his future on that night's events. As he thought about this, Yin, who was extremely excited, quickly made a phone call to his father. His father, who was still paralyzed in bed, connected the call as soon as he received it. Yin, where have you been the past few days? Why haven't you come to see me at all? Yin hurriedly replied, Dad. I am seeking medicine for you in Oris Hill. I heard that there's a genius doctor here who cured a patient with severe paraplegia not too long ago. Is that true? Fuji asked in surprise. Is there really such a magical doctor in Oris Hill who would be able to cure severe paraplegia? Yes, Yen replied. I've already checked the hospital records and confirmed that the patient has been cured of his severe paraplegia. I also asked around and everyone confirmed that the genius doctor was in fact the one who cured the patient with just half a magical pill. Half a magical pill, Fuji was very excited at this time. For the past four years, he had been in extreme pain and he had been suffering a lot because he had been paralyzed in bed. He had been a famous entrepreneur and he had endless wealth but he was suddenly paralyzed in bed. Just like that, he lost the opportunity to enjoy himself and live his life and that made him feel really miserable. In the past few days, he had been searching for various different ways to cure himself but in this world, there was absolutely no medicine to cure severe paraplegia and it was completely impossible to restore a paralyzed patient to his original condition. Even through intense physical therapy, it would be very difficult for the patient to stand up, let alone walk and live his life like an ordinary person. However, when Fuji heard his son saying that the genius doctor in Oris Hill had a form of superb medical treatment to cure severe paraplegia, he became very expectant and he was yearning for the cure. Fuji exclaimed excitedly, Yin, you have to buy this magical medicine back for me even if it's going to cost you more than hundred million dollars. Yin hurriedly explained, Dad, I don't know what's wrong with the genius doctor but he's simply unwilling to sell me the medicine. However, there's nothing you need to worry about because I'm already prepared to steal the medicine from him and send it to China tonight just so you can take the medicine as soon as possible. After that, Yen continued speaking, By the way, Dad, I heard that the genius doctor has more than just one of these magical pills. After eating one of the pills, we can get our team of researchers and analysts to study the ingredients in the magical pill and figure out its composition. After that, Suki Pharma will be able to develop this medicine and will definitely become the world's top pharmaceutical company then. We'll bring back and gain plenty of glory for China. Good. Excellent work, Fuji replied excitedly. You really deserve to be called my filial son. Make sure that you get this beautifully done for me as soon as possible. Yen replied, Don't worry, Dad. My private plane is already waiting for me at Oris Airport. After taking the medicine, I'll leave a few people behind before I fly back to China immediately. As long as I get into my private plane successfully, I will be able to fly back to China without any interference from anyone in Oris Hill. Fuji said excitedly, in that case, you will be able to arrive in China just four hours after the plane takes off. I can take this magical pill in less than five hours. I'll finally have an opportunity to stand up again. Yin burst into tears as he said, Dad. This is the blessing that you'll definitely enjoy endless glory, wealth, and a life free from illnesses. Okay, Fuji replied excitedly before he reminded Yen, Yen, you should be very careful and make sure you don't miss your flight. I will be waiting for your good news in China. Yen quickly said, Dad, you can rest assured. I'll definitely make it home with the magical pill so you'll be able to stand on your own two feet again.